Let's talk about diet sodas. You see them everywhere, from people who look like they might be trying to lose weight to people who clearly just love the drinks. But are they actually living up to their diet name? What is exactly in diet soda? What does it do to our bodies? Does it actually help us lose weight? There are five different kinds of FDA-approved artificial sweeteners, and when you pick up a diet soda, the sweetener you're most likely to guzzle down is aspartame, which is composed of two amino acids, aspartic acid and phenylalanine. Got it? Huh? Now, one of the more popular rumors about the sweeteners in diet soda is that it can cause cancer. And while there have been a few studies that link different sweeteners to cancer in rats, scientists don't think there's the same risk in humans. But this doesn't mean that these fake sugars don't do some funky stuff to our bodies. Sweeteners such as aspartame actually trigger our body's taste receptors and trick them into believing it's sugar. So, according to researchers at Purdue University, artificial sweeteners and diet sodas fulfill your body's sensory cravings for sweets. And, as advertised, they don't deliver the calories. But this is the problem. Diet sodas are actually crying wolf to your body. When this happens, your body becomes confused about how to respond when it's expecting sugar and doesn't get it. This has real physiological effects, and your body doesn't release the hormone that regulates blood pressure and blood sugar. Also, these sweeteners weaken the reward center of the brain, which could actually lead to increased appetite and overindulgence on real sweets. So the study found that artificial sweeteners can actually lead to weight gains. Wait, that's not what I signed up for. Now, it's worth noting that the American Beverage Association has disputed the reports, calling it an opinion piece. In the meantime, it's probably best to enjoy your favorite soda, diet or not, in moderation.